Hey guys, so I just got my first Blue Apron delivery. It's a big box and it's heavy. I haven't opened it yet, so I'm going to do it on video. Um, so first impressions, everything feels really cold. Um, it is a little wet on the side of the boxes. So it looks like it is all... Okay, hold on. It is all wrapped in this foil. And... Okay, hold on. Alright, so everything is packaged in the foil. There are these, I'm guessing the rescue cards. Yes, the rescue cards. They look really nice. Um, Alright, so it looks like you turn it sideways here. And then it just comes open. Alright, so let's see what we have in here. There's a lot of food in here. Alright, so let's see what we have. We have some parsley. Looks like it's nice and fresh. Some cherry tomatoes. They also look good. Uh, tomatillos. And everything is really cool. Um, everything is really cool. We have an onion, a yellow onion, some sweet potatoes, <laughs> cod knickknacks, and this smells really strong, so I don't know what we have in there. Um, okay, that's interesting. There's canned tomatoes. We didn't really expect to have anything canned, and some peppers. Some fresh thyme, some more parsley. Oh, we have another onion. Some fennel, some peppers. I still haven't gotten to the meat yet. All right, and we have an ear of corn, another sweet potato. What is this? Alright, so here's our wheat. It's interesting. It's just a little bit. I was kind of thinking that would be more. Um, what is this? Alright, so this is pork chop. Okay, something has spilled in here, I think, because like I don't know if you can see how it's wet. And it smells really strong, but this actually smells like this one, see where I think that one probably came open. So, I'm not quite sure what's in those yet. Um, but down here at the bottom, so we have this, which you can see is wet. This is um, where the meat is underneath this. So, okay. See, all of these smell kind of the same. And I'm guessing the knickknacks are like the little seasonings and spices. Alright, what do we have here? Okay, so this is what's keeping everything cold. This is our Nordic ice pack. Freeze and use as a long-lasting ice pack. Alright, so this is how everything is staying cold. It's a big old block of ice. Alright, so this is our pork chop, no antibiotic ever, vegetarian fed. It's a big pork chop. Looks nice. Uh, what is this? This is a chicken breast. Nice size. And this is our cod. So, I'm kind of confused here as to, I thought we were supposed to have two unless there's two in here, in which case they're not very thick. So, we will see. Um, so that's what I got. And there's another ice pack down here on the bottom. And then it looks like I didn't get one of the recipe cards out. Okay, fun facts. So this is about the Termitillo. It's just a little education thing, so that's kind of neat. 
I will say it's kind of messy. Stuff got a little bit wet, um, but overall everything is cold. And the ingredients I have are for pork chops and spicy chow chow, and seared chicken and caramelized vegetables, and Basque style cod. It shows you on each of the recipe cards the ingredients. Now one thing that I wish they would have done that they didn't do is I was hoping that they would keep all the ingredients like for this, the recipe. So like, you know, everything is just kind of in a little packet together for this recipe. You know, if that makes sense. Like just how this is. Um, but I guess you can look at the picture and separate stuff based on what it is. Um, I like that it tells you a little bit about the recipe and then it tells you even a wine pairing. On the back, they give you really clear instructions. And even shows you how to plate the dish. So that's nice. And also, um, they have cooking tips. And it gives you a website to go to. So each of these has everything about it. Um, and it also labels the recipe so you can look it up on their website. So I will do some more videos as I'm actually making this stuff and let you know. Overall, I'm pretty happy. I'm going to open up the... Um, the meats and see they don't look like they're very big and it's supposed to be for two people so we'll see how that goes um let me open up one of these little knickknack things here this is for the pork chops so it's this little brown bag okay and oh the mayonnaise look the mayonnaise op was open so i don't know how much of that was lost but that's definitely open and then this honey Dijon, honey Dijon mustard. And then you have a pepper and this. I'm thinking it's a shallot. So this is open. That is not a good thing. Let's see if any of these other ones are open. This is for the cod. So let's see what's in here. You have ground pepper and what is this? Almonds, cool. Oh, this is what I'm smelling. Sherry vinegar. And look, I'm not sure if this is supposed to be filled up all the way, but this is what I've been smelling this whole time. So I think this also leaked. All right. Now let's check out this third one, our seared chicken. Knickknacks is what they call it, and so this is just like the little extras and the seasoning. This one didn't want to come open. What is this? Okay, flour. Oh no, look. The sherry vinegar is spilled also. This is why my whole box smells like vinegar, so I don't have very much sherry vinegar, so that's kind of disappointing. And then this is... European style butter, so that's cool. I'm disappointed that the sherry spilled, so um, not the best, but all right. Well, that is my opening, and again, I'll do another video after I make one of the recipes. So, thanks for watching. Bye.